Dear students, I am Dr. Pravindji Pati. I am a faculty of psychiatry. And as you know, less than 40 days are left for our examinations. And every year uh, around this time, I, I talk to students. I try to make a video and I try to interact with them. And the reason why I do so is that this period, after the announcement of the result of the Central Institute and before the examination, the holiday examination, this period has always been very crucial as far as your results are concerned. Uh, in the last many years, I have witnessed so many students uh, who, who suddenly leapt forward and got a great rank uh, just on the basis of what they did in these 40 days. And that is why I always try to tell students that these 40 days are so crucial, so crucial, uh, you cannot even imagine how important they are. Uh, students, by this time, uh, what happens is a very small minority of students have already gotten selected in the uh, central institutes. Uh, earlier it used to be AIMS PGI, this it was INICT. But for majority of the students, the, the race is still wide open. And those who are able to conduct themselves properly, those who are able to continue studying hard, those who are able to take the preparation to the last day, uh, more often than not, these are the students who finally get selected. So if you are a student who is struggling, or if you are a student who thinks that the preparation is not optimal, or if you are a student who is lagging behind, or if you are a student whose grand test scores are not improving, or if you are a student who is thinking that whatever he or she had uh, learned in the starting months, you have forgotten everything, then please believe me, these 40 days or these 39 days or these 35 days can be a make or break for you. And the reason is simple. The reason is that in these 40 or 40, 35 days, multiple things will happen. First of all, the pressure will build up. Even those students whose preparation levels are good, they will start feeling the pressure and many of them will just drop out of this race. It's unfortunate, it's bad, but it happens every year. Every year I see so many students who have been preparing so well throughout the year, they just can't take the pressure anymore and they stop studying. And that is why the slots keep on opening up. And the second thing is, this is a period where if you mug like crazy, if you mug, you know, 10 hours a day or 12 hours a day, you, you get a distinct advantage uh, on, on the exam day because those things are still fresh in your mind. Somebody who has been studying for one year or one and a half year in this uh, scenario might find it difficult to, you know, take the momentum to that tack notch or take that momentum to that, that uh, level. But somebody who has not been studying that consistently but is starting late might have that advantage. They might just build that momentum. So I'm not saying that those who have been studying from the beginning are a disadvantage. That is not true at all. They of course have an advantage. But at the same time, we cannot say that the race is over. Even students who have started late, who are starting even today, they still have a chance. So when, when such less time is left, what should be your strategy? Students, when, when we have got less than 40 days for an examination like NEET PG, uh, strategies don't work. Logics don't work. Rationality takes a backseat. What works is pure passion. What works is stubbornness. What works is never give it up attitude. These are the things that will help you get a rank in this examination. If you can study like never before, if you can put so much effort, if you can, you know, uh, sit on that chair for 12 hours a day, if you can surprise even yourself, if you can give you the best performance of your life, then nothing is impossible. In fact, I can assure you, if even starting from today, you can you can give 10, 12 to 13 hours a day, you would definitely get selected. This is how it is. This is the truth. Students, please remember, all of us love stories in which everything is going wrong, wrong and suddenly something happens and you know, the tide turns. Somebody who has been struggling throughout, something happens and suddenly he wins the race. And this is the time to write that story for yourself. If you can give an amazing performance, if you can put an amazing effort in these 40 days or in these 35 days, you will remember that effort for the rest of your life. I have shared this in the past, but I'll, I'll again share this story. I am also one of those students who got selected in the last 40 days. 11 years back, during my internship, I decided to go for USMLE. 
I was always a good student. I went to US. I cleared step one, got a good result. I cleared CS examination uh, with good results. I did six months of electives and research, and finally I decided that I don't want to live in US. I decided to come back to India, and it was after Christmas that I reached back home. It was around Christmas I reached back home, and the examination was in the first week of February, and I had exactly forty days. In the beginning, I thought that this is impossible. People study for one year for this examination. and they have been studying so hard for the entire year how how can i ever compete with them i i am from ucms delhi and you know i went to that study room and i saw that everybody has been studying everybody is so serious and i was like man i have got this 40 days how can i compete with these people and they are only students from my college then there are people from mc and lady harding and then there are so many good students how can i compete with them and my first reaction was to or my my first thought was to give it up and my first thought was that i'll prepare next year but then thankfully i had a conversation with one of my good friends uh, somebody who, who whom i knew from the pmt days and and she told me that uh, you have always been a good student you should give it a shot you should give it a try and after deliberating upon that for a day or two i decided that i am i am trying to procrastinate i am trying to put this thing to next year just because i don't want to take pressure but the reality is that in life you cannot run away from pressure life is not simple in life you have to compete sometimes those battles are not easy sometimes you get bruised sometimes you get injured but nonetheless you have to fight and i decided that i will fight the day i decided that i'll fight the day i decided that i'll, I'll sit for the examination uh, everything with everything changed suddenly i i felt so much focus suddenly i felt so much energy and and i decided that i'll give up on everything i called my parents i was i was in hostel i called my parents and i told them that uh, please don't call me i'll call you myself whenever i get time I I called my friends and I told them that uh, you may not be appearing for this year but I have decided to give it a shot and I would not be able to talk to you. In fact, I became so dedicated that uh, every afternoon I would order the same food from the same restaurant and you know there, there was a restaurant who would send biryani uh, in 15 minutes and decided that I don't have time to wait for the food and I was not liking the mess food so I would order the same food every day just to save time. I I I made I made a pattern where I would get up in the morning and even before the daily chores even before having breakfast I would start studying study for 30 to 40 minutes then then start with the day I decided that I'll study for 45 to 50 minutes in one go and then take a break of 10 minutes and during that break I would not do anything else but listen to two or three songs motivational songs songs that I liked songs that pumped up my energy and would get back to the study table after that and in this fashion i started studying 12 to 13 hours a day now please remember students uh, throughout my mbbs as i said I, I i used to be hard working but i i could never clock 12 hours a day uh, at max i would study for 7 or 8 hours a day uh, when uh, the college was not there uh, and i i never knew that i i have that capacity to study for 12 hours a day but that is something that i discovered about myself i started studying for 12 to 13 hours a day in around uh, every 10 to 12 days i would take half a day off and then would get back to study and strange things happened during that time i was studying in the reading room the other students of my batch uh, they they were very surprised with what i am doing they would they would at times talk to me that uh, uh, are you sure you are going to appear for this year don't you think it would be better to appear next year some of them were polite and some of them would put it like this and then there were other people who would just you know mock me who would just laugh at me or give, give that sarcastic smile uh, that uh, uh, has the exam become so simple that people can just come and start studying and i would listen to it all i would never uh, fight with anybody uh, but you know I, i i would say it in my mind that that let's see what the result is you can laugh at me how much ever you want but we will we will see it on the result day and and i got better rank than most of those students in fact all those students who mocked me most of them could not even get selected so people will make fun of you people will mock you people will think say things like it cannot happen but if you are determined if you are dedicated miracles happen it happened with me and that is why every year i keep on telling students don't give up take the preparation to the last day magic will happen you will get selected you would not have imagined that in the wildest of your dreams but still it would happen those 40 days are still very fresh in my memory because i'm so proud of myself that i was able to do i, I was able to pull off something great in those 40 days and even during those 40 days uh, i felt very good whenever i would go to bed after studying for 12 to 13 hours a day you know that 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 feeling of satisfaction that feeling that i have used this day 
that feeling that i have honestly put in effort the feeling that i am doing something worthwhile that feeling is so nice that feeling is so intoxicating that feeling is so addictive even till today i feel the best when i study hard even till today i feel the best when i work hard and isn't it the, isn't it true for you too uh, compare compare two days uh, one day where you spend hours watching netflix or amazon or playing or you know going on a date and another day when you when you use the time properly when do you feel better isn't it true you feel better when you have utilized the day properly when you have studied properly this is we we are like this only we medical students we doctors are like this only in our heart we know what is true for ourselves and we can never fool ourselves if today you are sitting at your home or if today you are sitting at your hostel wasting time looking at instagram reels or youtube shorts or nonsensical videos here and there or just scrolling on your phone or watching amazon prime or netflix you know that you are not happy you know that you are irritated you know that you are frustrated you know that you don't like it why don't you change it what 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 do you need to do open that laptop open that mobile start watching those videos start doing those questions start reading those notes that is the only thing that can make you happy you cannot fool yourself period so guys please don't allow those thoughts to come in your mind that it is no longer possible it is always possible it is not over till it is over if you can ensure that you take this fight to the last day anything can happen so my only advice to you my only request to you is that please study like crazy i'm sorry i should not use this word crazy being a psychiatrist but i think that is the right word that is the only word that can that can you know convey the emotions that i want to convey if if you can study like anything in these 40 days or in these 35 days anything can happen and trust me guys on the day of the examination you will be so proud of yourself and on the day of results you would know that it was all worth it stop wasting time start studying make a strategy give yourself 10 minutes for making the strategy do as many questions as possible if you have some notes just start mugging them up just just start start you know rotifying them like anything and don't don't try to make too too elaborate plans when you try to make an elaborate plan you get demotivated this is not the time to make plans this is the time to take action once you are done with this video just just stop scrolling start studying that is the only thing that will make you happy believe me get a good rank and i will wait for your messages i'll i'll wait for your messages about the ranks that you got and trust me you'll get a good rank uh, send me a message we'll celebrate it together all the best god bless you